So how does that work when you actually get to the hospital? Is it like the movies or TV where you bust through the doors and, oh, he shot somebody, let's take him <laughs> to the emergency room and go straight to surgery? Like, how does that work? Yeah, kind of like it. Mm. it kind of like it. And do you actually have to go through surgery? It depends. See, I don't know if you got insurance. You probably do. I ain't have insurance. They put band-aids on me and sent me to the crib. I still got a bullet in my back right now. You feel me? So... I don't know. Like, they what I'm saying. Your situation might be different from mm. mine. You feel me? Like, is, Do they tell you this? Do they say, hey, we can do surgery, but since you don't have insurance, it's going to cost you this? No. Nah, like, I don't think they'll just tell you no know, shit like that. But no, nah, they, ain't, they ain't said it. You feel me? They just x-rayed me. You feel me? Seeing that one of the bullets went through, the other one stuck in my back. Patched me up. Shit. Police keep coming in and out asking me, could I get my folks to leave because there's too many people in the lobby and all type of crazy shit. You feel me? Like, but other than that, man, you feel me? They just banished me up here. I lived the same night. I went on the same night. You know what caliber bullet it was? I forgot to be in. I think it was a uh, 380 though. Can this bullet hurt you in a sense, being where it's at in your body currently? Yeah, it could. You could swim around or move around and... That motherfucker be moving. Like, I be feeling that shit. It be moving, but... It's nothing, though. You get what I'm saying? Like, that shit ain't... It's nothing. It's just some shit that went on. Oh, past. Nothing to you, but could be a big deal to somebody. Um, uh, can this bullet ever come out? Is that a possibility? It probably could. See, the horror down here for me behind the scene, like... Worse shit than that, so that shit ain't mm. shit to me. You know what I'm saying? What have you seen? I just seen a lot. My, I just, I seen a lot. You know what I'm saying? Been through a lot more than it, and seen a lot. So I mean, like it's, it's, it's that's normal. You see what I'm saying? Cause like a lot of folks getting hit and they die. I ain't die. You feel like about that shit, but. And that's another thing. I, I've. You know, uh, seeing people get hit one time. Yeah, and, and they die. Paraly- yeah, well, not even die. They might be paralyzed, paralyzed from the waist yeah, down. We, yeah, we've seen with it. With one bullet. Yeah, I've seen it. That's what I'm saying. Like, my little and shit And like you said, one bullet can kill somebody, too. Yeah, like, it'd been, it's a situation like that that been occurring around, like, one one gunshot and he ain't never going to walk no more. Uh, you see what I'm saying? Uh, they got to bury him next week. Like, my shit went like that, so it, like, Mine ain't nothing to be crying about. I'm straight. You get what I'm saying? Like, so I'm on some old shit. I ain't standing. You've had it. I saw you in the lobby, and yeah. you looked normal. Like, I had no idea you've ever been shot, because you walk normal. You look normal. Yeah. I wouldn't have been, I wouldn't have known unless we had this interview. Right, right. Well, yeah. So from the outside looking in, you look fine. Yeah. But uh, just curious, I mean, no insurance. I understand that. But did they say, like, you might need physical therapy for this? Did they say anything of that nature at all, or? I mean, no, they would say it, but I ain't do none of that shit, man. Did they give you medication at all? They did. I forgot what it was, but I don't, like, and then, then, like, I hated drugs. You get what I'm saying? Like, I, I still do got my little thing against drugs. Drugs just ain't, you feel me? So I never, I ain't want to take whatever it was that was prescribing me and shit, you know. You don't uh, mess with drugs, period? Nah, I smoke now, you know what I'm saying, but not nothing major, but I, you know, now I do my... Tobacco, marijuana? Yeah, I hate tobacco. I hate it. Aside from it moving around, are there any other complications? Nah. What about when it rains or it gets cold? Yeah, that's it. Like, that's the one. When it rains, that shit, man. But outside of that, no. Like I said. What happens when it rains? Can you explain? When it rains, shit, I just go through my phone, find me a bad ass bitch, and just get my back massage, my dick so shit like that. <laughs> keep my mind off the pain. I don't want no meds. It does get painful in the rain. Yeah, it do. How long did it take before everything felt normal again, though? I, Af- after they bandaged you up? See, when I got to the, well, at the time, 
you know, I was going through shit with my old lady. This who gotta take care of me because my arm in the sling. You know what I'm saying? So like, like, I got a I got a different type of respect level for handicapped people because you don't know how it feels to not have not be be able to use your you know what I'm saying to have one arm like all people that just missing a finger or missing anything and you know what I'm saying like that shit is like hell bro like trying to get shit done one arm like a man trying to tie your shoe with one hand you feel me? like. That shit, and then, especially if you, if you short fuse and you get frustrated easy, you know what I'm saying, with no help. So, I mean, like, other than that, though, like, after I got past that little state, it wasn't nothing but a week or two of that. When I got past that, I would pretty much straight. But, yeah, like, I got a different respect level for people that, you know what I'm saying, that's disabled or handicapped people. I just say that because, shit, like, whatever it is, like, we don't know how that feel, you know what I'm saying, for that person to be going through that. So, it like, yeah. I, I got a different respect level for those type people. Um, I know you didn't do physical therapy or anything like that, but looking back, do you wish you would have? Do you wish you would have followed doctor's orders at all of whatever they explained to you or said to you? Or Hell no. I be paying them folks to this day. <laughs> so, no. I was great. Like, I was, I was, when that shit healed up, I'm all right. I mean, like, see, it's nothing, bro. I mean, 